Hey everybody, Colin from Peace Through Anarchy Blog again, here with another video talking about Obamacare. Now let's go flash back to 2013 when Obama signed the Obamacare Act into effect. He, you ever, everywhere you went, you saw the video of him smiling as he signed the document, stating that everybody, you know, across the United States needed a health care plan. But then he saw the little African American boy standing right next to him with a little smile on his face. And then he looked up and he saw Obama with the huge smile on his face. Unfortunately, what the little kid doesn't know is that the smile on his face was the smile of him not knowing what the fuck he was signing. Now, the whole thing behind Obamacare in the first place was Obama was looking to sign something into effect for some sort of health care plan, some sort of what they call, you know, the affordable health care plan act is what it's called um and so he's looking to do something like that so he stopped and he thought to himself you know how can we do this so he brought in his cronies and said to them give me a bill and i'll sign it and then his little crooked ass cronies went to work like the little working elves they are <laughs> and they wrote up this thick piece of paper this thick document that stated you know, everything that you see now, which is from, you know, if you don't have the health care, you know, they're going to charge you like $95, you know, for the first year that you don't have health care. Then it's going to go up and up and up and up. And I'm one of those people who doesn't have health insurance. So, you know, it affects me. And also being, you know, of the generation, you know, you saw what life was like before Obamacare. I got to tell you, life was pretty good. You know, you didn't have to worry about, you know, all this shit that you do now with your taxes and stuff like that. But it was just one of those things, too, where it's like because, the you know, the reason why we didn't need health insurance is because we, we took care of ourselves. That's just plain and simple. The only reason why people needed health care in the first place is because of medical conditions passed on from family to family member, you know, that kind of thing. And then there's just the people who straight up just don't know how to fucking take care of themselves. You know, people who just don't care about their body. They want to destroy themselves. You know, then it ends up putting them in an early grave. And that sucks. That's the only reason why people, you know need health insurance and quite frankly you should be penalizing those people and not me I'm a fucking vegetarian I know how to take care of myself and the, the worst part about all of this is is that you know the healthcare, the healthcare companies and big pharma it's all just a big fucking business now it's not like everything was back in the old days where you had a doctor or like you know a shaman you know somebody like that in the old villages and the old towns and stuff like that who just came to you know the aid of the people because you know that's what the people needed now it's like oh we're just gonna give you a bunch of pills and th it may do this and it may do that and it may give you a bunch of side effects that might actually kill you instead of heal you or make you worse and make you sicker and may have allergic reactions to that's what it's come down to in this country we're not fucking trying to do medicinal herbal remedies you know the big industries are rejecting medicinal marijuana and cannabis oil and so on and so forth. You know, I don't do none of that stuff. I don't smoke. I don't drink or anything like that. I'm straight edge. But it's one of those things where it's like I've seen how cannabis affects people. I know it's positive. Instead of freaking rectal bleeding or anal seepage or you might get dizzy if you're driving a truck or something like that. That's the fucking big pharma aspect. They don't want to make you healthier. They just want to see you die. And I guarantee you that's the reason why they make these pills because it's the process of elimination they just want to thin out the herd make it so that more americans who freaking don't trust the government who don't trust big pharma they want to weed those people out and make the people of america who do follow the government who just do support the government make them even more mind-controlled sheep than they already fucking are and that's basically your medical system here in the united states in a fucking nutshell